Many celebrities have spoken about BTS's performance at the 2022 Grammy Awards, and today, we're gonna go through a couple of their reactions. First up is Olivia Rodrigo, who was spotted dancing in the audience of the Grammys. She was also supporting them while they were singing better. Next up is Lady Gaga, who V revealed that Gaga said she loved their performance, and said that Gaga is a big fan of BTS. She also told V that she's cheering for them. Third is Billie Eilish, who was allegedly seen bowing in the audience when they came on, and even left a comment on Instagram praising them so much and said that BTS deserved better. This was in response to the lack of awards given to BTS at the Grammys. Fourth is Halsey, who said that BTS killed their performance. In fact, Halsey was anticipating their performance so much that she posted on her Instagram story. She posted to say that she only stayed at the show to support BTS, and went straight home after they were done singing. In the middle of the Grammy ceremony, Halsey left the venue. In her post on her Instagram story explaining this, she said, I wasn't feeling super well, so I left early. I had to see BTS though. Going to get pasta and sleep. Thanks for everything. Love you all. And finally, Doja Cat showed her support for BTS by saying that BTS are not given enough recognition. This is because BTS didn't win anything at the Grammys. BTS have established themselves a solid fan base of the general public. They also have celebrities and music insiders such as critics on their side too. It's not hard to see why they're still going from strength to strength, especially considering how much support they have. BTS get widespread acclaim for the fact that they're able to appeal to all types of people and all ages of people. This is something that most other artists are unable to achieve. In other BTS news, JK recently suffered a problem with an obsessed stalker fan. On a recent Live, JK was in his hotel room listening to music and talking to fans. Then during the live stream, the phone in his hotel room suddenly rang before turning off. Then, moments later, the phone rang again, and JK momentarily went away from the camera to get the phone. When JK returned, he started started saying please don't prank call. Once again, the hotel phone rang and JK let out a sigh saying, that ringtone is creepy. It gives me goosebumps. JK went off camera to pick up the phone and returned again. He then came back and said, hey, you're watching this broadcast, right? Who is this? Fans asked JK who it was and he replied by saying that he doesn't know. Later, the phone rang again. It was confirmed that it was not a hotel staff, but it was an obsessed fan who was calling JK's hotel room. Because the phone kept ringing throughout his V-Live, a staff member finally came to take the phone away. For this video's comment question, how long have you been a fan of BTS for? Before you go, be sure to give this video a thumbs up and subscribe for daily news updates on BTS. Thanks a lot for watching.